What's going on guys? It's your boy Mac in Action. I'm here outside of Third Coast Gym. It's located around the northwest area, northeast, just outside Houston. With the owner today, what's your name, bro? My name is uh, Francisco, but I go by Frankie. Let me ask you this. What was some of your motivation to starting up this new gym? Uh, one of my main motivations to start out, just being passionate about fitness. I really love the gym, so I decided to make my own gym. Okay. Pretty much he's going to give us a tour of his gym, and we're going to talk a little bit about the equipment. Go check it out, hit a workout real quick. And let's go. I actually was looking into warehouse style gym. I think those are my favorite kinds of gyms. Mm -hmm. Kind of reminiscent of like the old school bodybuilding uh, type feeling. So that's what I went with. Um, I try to organize our machines. Uh, anyone with a military background, we definitely like our organization. Yeah, sure triceps and for our females we got a uh, glute machines i did not leave out the females get that butt work on it go <laughs> and all we use is iron weights you know we're not like planet fitness or la fitness <laughs> i don't like using those rubberish weights it's nothing better than putting iron on that bar yeah and when you hear when you hear those iron weights jingle yeah, something about that sound huh yeah something about that sound kind of yeah. like a like a diesel engine starting in the cold <laughs> okay okay I'm praying within the year 2024 mm -hmm. I get big to where I can expand okay. and uh, double the size. And once I'm able to double the size, one size is gonna be all upper body, one side is gonna be all lower body. What kind of tips do you have to somebody that wants to start off their own gym? First, have a plan. Okay. Once you're like already in your unit, my second tip is take it slow. Take it slow? Right, because once I got all this, like I got all this equipment mm -hmm. and I got it in my mind like, oh, I wanna buy this, oh, I wanna get this, yeah. I wanna get this, no. So right. just, just take your time. Yeah. And take your time, plan that out is pretty much what you're saying? Yeah. Yeah, okay. Do you have any, like, maybe, like, community events that you have planned or anything that you have in mind for the community? Actually, my wife told me this. Uh, once I'm able to, like, have, a, like, a huger base, mm -hmm. definitely look into doing powerlifting competitions here. Oh, okay, cool. I see your vision. I see what you have going on. I do see this gym, you know, the potential and eventually in the future growing to the bigger unit. And, uh, you know, I just wish you the best, bro. All right, yeah, well, enough of the tour. It's time to get this workout in, get, get a little pump in to start our day right. And yeah, let's get this workout in. We just got done doing the warm up. We are going to try to hit either 75s or 80s today, which I've only gone up to 75s ever. And I only did like six reps, but I might try 80s today, depending how I feel. I do feel pretty good right now. And I don't know, I think I can. We did start off with the flat bench, doing a dumbbell press. Now we're going to probably go up in weight. Before going up in weight, I'm going to hit the 70s real quick. <sighs> Let's go. I'll probably only do like five reps because I do want to try 80s today. Five reps, y'all. That's five, y'all. Oh, shit, I'm already dying. A little tough, but it's all right. I got it. I got it. All right, so don't forget to wipe your equipment down after you're done using it. Clean that shit, bro. I ain't gonna lie, I think I might have gone too hard because my shoulders already feeling it, my chest is already pumping. But we're gonna keep going. We're probably gonna do cable flies for low um, upper chest and lower chest, and then we're gonna hit a little bit of triceps. Usually, I do like to start off doing, uh, I like doing three sets of incline, upper incline, middle, and then lower. So let's set it up for incline. I, I am kind of short, so gotta bring it down a little bit. Bring this side down too. And we're gonna start up with overhead incline. Oh shit. <laughs> Actually, let me go a little bit lower. <laughs> nah, let me see. I ain't no bitch. <sighs> All right, so above the head. Damn. You do get 
a pretty good grip with these handles. So that's done. Now I do a middle, then lower. Chest kind of killed me because I think I went too hard at the beginning, but hey, now we're gonna do tricep, get a little pump in. And we are gonna go to the shooting range later, so you already know, gotta get that tricep going. Tricep and chest, a little bit of shoulder. What are you trying to say, bro? Dude, my cousin just offended me saying put the weight down. Like, I'm not stronger than that motherfucker. Let me show you something real quick, bro. This is not even heavy, dude. See, this is why I don't like doing rope, because it's too easy for me. <laughs> to finish it off, we are going to do a push-up challenge, and whoever loses has to pay for our protein meal after this shit. I don't know. I think he's gonna win, but I'm giving my best. Tired of shit. I'm not gonna let you down, guys. Ready? <laughs> Why he gonna look at me like that? <laughs> hey, you're not going all the way down. You gotta do it for your guys. Who is gonna win? Oh. No. I think he's gonna win. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry, y'all. I tried my best. I guess I gotta pay for the food now. Be ah. sure, bro. Well, that was it for the gym. I'm gonna be honest, that shit was fire, man. Make sure you go check out my boy Frankie. Now, we're gonna go eat some food because I haven't ate shit all day and it's already 2 p.m. We're gonna go fuck some shit up in the shooting range. We got like, like, like four or five guns that we're gonna shoot. And I haven't gone to a shooting range in like probably like like three years now, so I already know my aim is gonna be trash. But I'm just gonna imagine that I'm shooting my ops, cause I, I got ops out here, man. <laughs> I don't know what we're gonna eat, but for sure it gotta be some protein, man. Did you really work out? If you don't come to Chipotle right after, I don't think so. But you already know I gotta get that bowl, get some chicken, some steak, extra rice, cheese, tortilla on the side. That's my thing. That shit gonna smack because I haven't any shit only in Apple this morning. So I usually get a bowl, chicken, steak, and just white rice. You know I gotta get them games, y'all. We're out here in Chipotle. Uh, can I get a bowl? White. Uh, pinto beans. Can I get steak and chicken? Are you, you saying hi to the video? Yeah. What's up, y'all? Shout out to the workers here. Uh, can I get double chicken or chicken and steak? Yeah, we just came out of the gym, so we gotta get them games. Yeah. I just get cheese and a little bit of lettuce, but just on one side though. Yeah, because I ain't gonna finish it, so you gotta see some for tomorrow, y'all. Oh, and then can I get a tortilla on the side? Yeah, this is Chipotle hack. If you get a tortilla on the side, you can just make your own burrito. Hey, bro, wrist it up real quick. Wrist <laughs> it up, bro. I need to be shy, bro. But how is Chipotle gonna have like healthy food, but they don't have no healthy drinks? Look at all this, full of sugar. But I can't do no coke diet because that shit's too like shit. I might just end up doing the lemonade, even though it's too like shit, but I guess I got no other option. Let's try the lemonade, organic, supposedly. Not bad. But is it really organic though? I don't know, they be lying out here. Here's what the bowl looking like. Some slight. All games. Yeah, my boy got the sissy sauce. Might make it a little sesty after that shit. Tell a couple bells, came in this shit by myself. Dog, why you fuck this girl? Oh, uh, shit, cause I'm a player. We just pulled up to the range. It is my first time here to this location, so I'm not really sure if it's indoor or outdoors. But we're gonna be meeting up with my boy Manny. I know some of y'all might know him from my last video. He was the one recording me. We're gonna meet up with him. Then my cousin's in the background. That boy Manny. Shout out for the way, bro. You mad? No, I'm just bored, bro. You look mad as shit, bro. 
I feel kind of bad because he's been waiting here for like 40 minutes now. <laughs> it's just that I have to go home and get my charger and stuff, so. Oh, and my ID because I forgot my, my driving license, so. Don't carry no ID. Can you be like nice to me, bro? <laughs> I'm about to shoot my cousin's Glock. I did used to have a Glock back in the day until it got stolen, so I'm about to reminisce a little bit with my Glock, so. <laughs> Memories. Memories. We gotta shoot the 357, y'all. And I shot it earlier, that motherfucker has some power, so. What do you think about it so far, bro? Well, we tried a lot of guns. We did, we did. The, the revolvers, they, they better. That shit got some power to that. Yeah, yeah. I ain't gonna lie, my head's kinda hurting right now. Especially after that workout. It was like a second workout, back to back, man. Right? Yeah. <laughs> now we're gonna do a challenge, see who can hit the long range a little better. With the 357 Magnum. All right, here's my boy Manny going first. Okay, a little outside the circle. Was it down or was it Kind of the same spot. Let me show him how it's done, man. <laughs> Bro, I'm about to show you how it's done, all right? All right, all right. All right, my turn. We're going to be doing this one. 357 Magnum. I'm about to show you how it's done, all right? Fuck. You know what? That one didn't count because I wasn't ready. Yeah. Uh, you know what? Fuck it. At least I tried. At least I hit the paper. Alright, let's see what my cousin got. Here, yeah, I, I guess. Stay in school. Don't do drugs. Join the Air Force. Right? It's actually my first time shooting a gun. I usually don't do nothing instead of the office, but it was a good experience. <laughs> the shooting range was pretty cool. It was my first time shooting a lot of the guns that, you know, I've never shot before, and it has been over two years that I've came to a shooting range. I kind of want to keep coming. Shout out my boy Manny again. He's the one that brought the revolvers, the, the big uh, 357s, right? So he brought the 357s. That shit hurt my hand. So, bro, you owe me a massage. Hey, go ahead and like and subscribe because I'm gonna, it's going to be a bitch today just cleaning all that fucking shit up. On <laughs> yeah, so shout out my boy Manny. I ain't going to do shit. He's just brought the guns. I brought a little bit of ammo. So if you want to see more gun content, comment down below because we're going we gonna to go crazy this year, right? 2024? Yeah, yeah, this is 2024, Texas. bro, we're going crazy, man. Shout out my connection. Shout out myself for putting in the hard work. Shout out to my boy Manny for the camera work. Yeah. And also shout out my boy uh, Santiago. Cause when I'm a boy Chago and Manny, I don't know how the fuck my videos will be done because these my boys are here. They help me uh, record. They help me do everything, y'all. So shout out to them. Follow them on Instagram too. Follow me on IG. Yeah. All right, y'all. Well, that's been it for the video. I hope you liked it. I hope you liked the shooting content, the gym content. Make sure you stay tuned for the next video. So I'm going to be doing a video every five days. So make sure you tune in, make sure you keep liking the videos, commenting your favorite part of the videos, and keep sharing, y'all. Peace.